Hello everybody and welcome back to Ms. Pac-Man Maze Madness. We're gonna enter a year of the pack. What a good little witch's helper! She's collecting the gems for me! <laughs> yes, we are collecting the gems, but we're gonna use them for a different purpose. So yeah, this has to be my favorite soundtrack in the entire game. It's pretty relaxing. The only thing I don't like about this level is the end. You'll find out why in a little bit. One of my interesting facts about Pac-Man that I read in the last video of somebody getting the highest score that you could possibly get on the game, well, interesting Pac-Man fact number 24 says it is impossible to score higher than that because of a bug in the game that turns the screen to gibberish on the 256 screen. Now I'm curious if there's a video of that somewhere. There we go. More explosive guys. Okay, let's respawn these. And we're gonna blow this one up first. And then we'll push this one over here and get rid of that spawner. And you're stuck. Bye! Okay, let's get the strawberry. Nothing over here. Okay. Took me a second to remember what I had to do here. So let's blow that up. Move this one down here. Um, let's get rid of that TNT real quick. Then we'll move this one. Over here. Oh geez, more explosive guys. Oh crap. Oh 
Okay, I'm tempted to just get rid of that thing. Let's do it. And there's a dragon behind there. So let's set him free, because we need him. What the? Not sure how that happened. I must have ran into that explosive. Okay, sir. I want you to blow that up for me. Thank you. Ouch, that literally took half my health. What the- what is that? Oh, that's where he respawns. Okay. Okay, let's move this down. And boom. Uh, wait a second. I screwed up. There we go. I needed those. So, interesting Pac-Man fact number 25. The success of Pac-Man inspired U.S. distributor Bally Midway to create a series of mostly identical sequels. Ms. Pac-Man, Pac-Man Plus, Junior Pac-Man, Baby Pac-Man, which added a mini pinball table under the monitor, and Professor Pac-Man. Interesting Pac-Man fact number 26 says... Professor Pac-Man was a quiz game depicting Pac-Man in a mortar board and glasses. It was not a success. Well, what do you expect when you try to make a quiz out of a game? When you're a kid, the last thing you want to do is a quiz, even if it's about a game. Because, I mean, you got quizzes and tests when you're in school, so why would you want to do it outside of school? Okay, Mr. Ghost, I need you to help me out here. I need you to blow these up. There's one. Ouch. Whoops. Okay, let's try this again. Come on. Any second now.
I did not mean to do that again. So I decided to just skip past that part since it wasn't important. Anyway, here is the end of the level, but there's a lot of stuff we have to do. And I decided to speed it up because it took me quite a while to figure out how to open the gate to exit the level. So, anyway, I'll put it back to normal speed once I get close to figuring it out. Time, I got it. Okay, can I get out of here without dying? Thank you, thank you, thank you. Alright, that is the end of the episode. I hope you guys enjoyed. I will see you guys in the next one. Bye!